So, friends, uh, first of all, we need to uh, first thing that we learn uh, about how to be set free from this uh, uh, worry is we learn uh, in Philippians chapter 4 and verse 6 that we can come to the Lord in everything. You see, you, you can come to the Lord in prayer concerning every affair of your life. For example, right now, you know, we are in the midst of this uh, coronavirus pandemic days. Everywhere there is hopelessness, there is confusion. And so, we don't know what to do concerning, our, concerning the future of our life, our work, our family, our uh, children's life. You know, we are confused about everything. So, the Lord, the first thing that the Lord is saying to us is, from Philippians chapter 4 and verse 6, the second part is, the Lord says to us, come before God, come to God in prayer concerning every affair of your life. Don't think that you can come to God only about certain things, about only your children or uh, about something else. The Lord says, come to me in everything, concerning everything in your life. So friends, that's the first thing that we learn. Come before God in prayer concerning everything in your life. Let us pray together. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I, I come before you, Lord. Father, we pray for every one of them who is watching this message. Father, we learn the truth. How? We must go before God in everything, from the smallest to the biggest issue of life. Father, I pray today that you will teach your children that they will, they will make, make this their lifestyle, O Lord. That they will, they will stop coming before you only in the big things of life which they can't handle. Yes, Lord. I pray that they will stop making that a habit and that they will now from now on make it a habit to come before you even in the most smallest issues of life where they think that they can handle it. Even in those issues, let them come before you. Seek, seek your guidance. Seek your uh, help, O oh Lord. And get, cast their burden on. Even in the smallest issue, issues of life, let them cast their burdens on to you, O oh Lord. Let, may, let, may they make this their practice of their life. I pray that the Holy Spirit will will change them according to the truth that we learn from Philippians chapter 4 and verse 6 that in everything you can come before God. In Jesus name I thank you that you are changing your people's life like that. In Jesus name I pray. Amen. Amen.